think it's been confirmed that Juan Soto Yankee cards and Otani's Dodgers cards, which are both super short print, have been mixed in with the base cards in 2024 Series 1 and are not in the normal hit spot. So if you are ripping 2024 Series 1, you're going to want to check all your cards for, you know, first card and especially these because I'm assuming Juan Soto Yankee cards and Otani Dodgers super, super short prints are selling for a decent amount of money because that is their first card as a Yankee and as a Dodger. Pretty dope of Toss to throw them in there for that. I'm just saying if there's a Juan Soto Yankees card that somebody has at a decent price, I am a buyer. I am a buyer. Man, this is the kind of stuff, you know, this would have been a little bit more hype for them to put out before the fact, right? Like, let us know that this is in there. Yeah. You know, say no. There's been that. Then there was the Kevin Harden news didn't come out until after the release. The first that's on yeah. my topic I, i'm sure it is the 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 first all that stuff never came out until after the release it now it's been out since last week and now we're talking about it right like this would have been some stuff we would have been talking about two weeks ago i mean like bro top mm-hmm. series one you know it it's a crazy massive you know break it was 2400 cards a case um but you know this is the top so you're dropping the ball on this like let us know this stuff up front let us get it out into the market let's talk to about the talk about it, it creates more people. hype it generates right more hype. right there was like zero hype on series one i mean it was it was all right we ripped a couple a few cases but you know it was like the top series one you're just buying because you're like all right cool i'm just gonna get the first rookie card like of ellie data mm-hmm. cruz and i'm gonna get it out there and my goal is is to buy into 50 of these breaks spend you know a thousand bucks or whatever it is. And then I'm just going to freaking flood eBay with them either graded or ungraded raw and try to make my money back just by being the first one on the market with all these cards. Exactly.